Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel Tech Control. Finally, the US Navy just unveiled the world's most expensive drone. One such example is the Northrop Grumman X-47B, an unmanned combat aerial vehicle UCAV, built to demonstrate autonomous launches and recoveries from aircraft carriers. This aircraft emerged from the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency's DARE-PA, Joint Unmanned Combat Air Systems GUCAS program, driven by the U.S. Navy's interest in using unmanned aircraft for reconnaissance, penetration into protected airspace, and target identification for further attacks. Since the early 2000s, Northrop Grumman began developing this aircraft, starting with the X-47 a Pegasus, which served as a stepping stone for further advancements. The X-47B was completed in 2008, with its first taxi tests conducted shortly after. Finally, in 2011, the X-47B successfully completed its first flight at Edwards Air Force Base in California, reaching an altitude of 5,000 feet while performing basic maneuvers to collect test data and assess its guidance systems. Following these initial successes, the aircraft was tested for carrier-based launches, beginning with the U.S. George H. Hobush, where it utilized the catapult system for takeoff. Subsequent tests were conducted aboard other carriers, such as the U.S. Harry S. Truman, demonstrating the aircraft's versatility across different operational settings. Transporting and loading the X-47B onto aircraft carriers is a complex process. If the carrier is in shallow waters, barges are used to transport the aircraft from port before cranes lift it onto the flight deck. Once positioned, the aircraft is secured to the catapult system, and the control team configures its software and electronics before launching it into flight. To explore the full capabilities of the X-47B, Night tests were conducted to assess its operational performance in low visibility conditions. These tests also evaluated the aircraft's lighting and navigation systems, as well as its ability to coordinate with the carrier's crew. Once the X-47B's flight precision was confirmed, further trials focused on autonomous aerial refueling in collaboration with an Omega K-707 tankered aircraft. Using GPS and communication systems, the X-47B maintained a fixed altitude and employed a refueling interface system to receive fuel mid-air. These advancements led to the development of programs such as the Carrier-Based Aerial Refueling System CBRS, which later resulted in the MQ-25 Stingray, an unmanned aerial refueling aircraft. The MQ-25 is equipped with an aerial refueling store mounted under its wing, utilizing a flexible hose and a drogue or basket at the end to stabilize the fuel transfer process. The successful demonstration of these technologies has driven further innovation in unmanned aircraft designs for multiple applications. The U.S. Navy officially adopted the MQ-8 in 2009, integrating advanced weaponry, such as the Advanced Precision Kill Weapon System AP -OS, a laser-guided 70mm rocket, along with sophisticated navigation and reconnaissance equipment.